Today in New Tribe Sessions we have a lovely band that is called Liz and the Lofty Things. Hello everybody, how are you? Good. Good. How are you? I'm good, thank you very much. Lovely to have you here. Thanks for having us. I would like to ask you a couple of things. I've heard that you have recently released a new single. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, sure. We released a single called Your Waltz and uh, it's the first single from an album that we're releasing later in the spring, early summertime. And it's a song about the early stages of love, so it's kind of a sweet song in that way. It's lovely, sounds really amazing. I've heard that it has uh, been released in a couple of uh, Spotify and iTunes, where people can reach it? Yes, yeah, Spotify, iTunes, Amazon, Google Play. I think it's on about 200 different online platforms. So, whatever flavor of online listening, purchasing of music you want to access it on, you can. <laughs> and what instruments you have in the band at the moment playing? So, it's set? the four of us I play guitar and sing, and Karina plays violin, Chris plays uh, fretless bass uh, with nylon strings which we were going over earlier today, pre-interview, mm -hmm. uh, which has a very specific sound. Uh, and then Katie plays drums. You're listening to New Tribe, and we're listening to Lofty Things. This is your what? Great, I would like to ask you a little bit about how you got together. Well, Chris and I, Chris plays bass, we oh. met first <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, and we were both playing a gig at a place called The Slaughtered Lamb in Camberwell and uh, we had a chat after the show. That's right, I was playing there and you were also playing your own set. You yeah. were on your own then, weren't you? Yeah, Just I was solo totally on my own. And I, and I loved your set and I said, oh, can I come and play bass with you? And I think it was about a year later when you phoned up and said yes. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what was that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was uh, gone a good number of years ago. I'd say about eight years ago, maybe? Quite mm. Just when I was starting out, I think that was a gig that happened just after I'd uh, done like a little bit of um, going to open mics and kind of testing my material out and getting getting a little bit more used to performing um, and then that was kind of like a proper gig that I did and then uh, obviously met Chris and uh, was really keen to start something up that was bigger but at the time I was uh, studying at university and so um, made him wait for a year. Sorry about that. <laughs> Worth it though, yeah. Lovely. And now you have a couple of other members. Can you tell me a little bit about who they are and what they playing? Yeah, so Karina came next. Yep. Uh, and we met uh, through work actually. Through work, yeah, where we played after we finished working together. Yeah. So, yeah. And uh, and Karina told me that she played violin, and I was like, brilliant! Come be in the band. Uh, and uh, obviously she had listened, decided that she she wanted to to be part of it, and uh, and then she wrote to Cadian, who plays drums. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the silent drummer. <laughs> Hi, you're listening to New Tribe, and we're listening to Lofty Things. And we're going to start us off with Call to Rome.
performance how do you how would you describe the way of your performance like your style of music maybe i don't know well it's it's based around folk um mm -hmm. i think what's really interesting about uh what we all kind of bring to each song is that we come from very different backgrounds in terms of what we we've studied um and styles of music that we've played you know when when we were learning and also being in bands and gigging and um, playing for fun. So I think that probably all of us bring a little bit of those influences to what we play. You're listening to New Tribe. We're Liz and the Lofty Things, and this is Cradle. <laughs> 